The key keeper's getting ready to take the uh, Yazoo mower down off the trailer here. That's the that's the green option. We didn't have to start the motor if you look, to get it off of there. It gone easier. And there's no risk of crashing it into your Oldsmobile. Moldsmobile. No, it's not the Moldsmobile. Unless you turn it turn it off with the air on. I think it's just stinking like somebody threw up in it. Boy, that starter sounds good. Put a new one on. There he goes. All right. I'm gonna go check the tractor out. There is a large quantity of sweat bees in here. I believe I'm going to start this tractor and get out of here in case there are any real bees in here. Uh oh, she won't go into gear. That would be bad. All right. Off the Yazoo. Okay, so we've had a we've had a rash of gas thefts out here. So we've been emptying the gasoline out of this old tractor. We haven't seen the uh, we haven't seen the 420 yet, although we heard a bunch of sirens a little while ago off in the distance. So hopefully he's going to show up here in about another half an hour. Otherwise, we're going to have to go looking for him. But we might not see him for a while because we have this superior uh, all-natural 100% green privacy fence. All right, this thing ought to start easier now. Let's give it a try and see. There we go. I'll actually put it in reverse. I'm not going to hit the key keeper's big brown piece of crap today. Well, look what finally made it. The John Deere 420 is here. I have to find the key keeper. This is what he's been living for. All right. The key keeper finally gets his turn. Ow. Let's see what he's got here. There's the Yazoo. Definitely built in an era before operator safety was the primary concern. But it'll mow. If you put it in gear, you better get ready to mow. All right, you ready to do this? Yeah. Show us. Here he goes. That old mower runs great. Trademark two cylinder sound. And that thing, it doesn't look like much, but it sure will mow till the cows come home. This thing looks like it might be on uh, on fire a little bit at least. I don't know. Oh well, get back up there and start up again with it. See if maybe I can uh, somehow ease that back over into where it belongs. Because it is really, really loud. Oh, well, Bizarre Furheads had a breakdown too. Wonder what went wrong. I just lost half of our mowing, uh, mowing armada. Well, okay. There that is fixed again. I'll tell you what. When all else fails, speak softly and carry a big stick. See if that quieted it down a fair bit. Oh, that's a lot better. It was really getting to be a headache mowing with that pipe off like that. Let's go see what happened to Bizarre Furhead. Oh my goodness! What has he done? That's not good. He had a belt catastrophe. Oh, a belt catastrophe. 
Wow, he even tried to break it and wow, I'll bet that's, uh, that's actually fairly warm. <laughs> that belt actually broke in multiple places. Well, it had a big cut out of it. And I'd say this is where the cut might have been. Oh, definitely. Or maybe here. So does it still drive at all? or? Yeah, I just noticed it, it was like, bam! Oh, all, like, we, oh, oh. all we did was, so, this is the main, drive, main deck drive belt. Oh, okay, so it's not the end of the world. Uh -uh. Well, how's the 420 doing? Great. Sounds good, too. Except a little hiccup in the way in. Well, we've all had that, especially on chilly night. <laughs> <laughs> all righty. Well, I just uh, I tried to take the muffler off the Alice over there. It was, it was quite loud. Yes, I did, and I think I fixed it the same way. I used a big stick. <laughs> <laughs> what Dad say? He said he'd be over here in a minute. All right, back to mowing. Well, there I was going along so nicely, and all of a sudden. There's a smoking ruin left laying in the grass. I came this close to hitting it with the deck. Shoey. Yeah, we're just gonna have to let that cool. But it's a good deal louder now. Although not truly, uh, not truly as bad as it could be, really. I fire this up here and uh... You give it a listen for yourself. Definitely, uh, definitely has a bit of a different sound to it, but I don't think that I can put it back on now. I think this muffler has uh, performed its last. Of course, it's a lot louder when you have it under load. Listen to this. Our casualty. That's what you get for using one of them orange tractors. You should have got yourself a good green and yellow one. Well, you're you're only scoring about 50% here because the 316 tossed its deck belt, Why shredded not it to pieces. We're talking about belts here. We're talking about tractors. Well, I guess to be fair, it did get up on the trailer I under its own power. Brother Jetstar out, boy. Uh oh. Sound like sounds like our next casualty is near. I'm hearing that Wisconsin engine start to stutter and stumble. Isn't that what the famous for? Well, yeah, but this one was running pretty well. <laughs> yeah, nothing beats an old John Deere two-cylinder. Yeah, right. Yeah, I think he's out of gas. Ain't Quick, yet. to the gas can. <laughs> no, he's still trucking. Oh wow, you got it going again. Well, duh! I see that new fuel pump you put on it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's almost out of gas. Bring it out of it? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I think we got a stuck valve on the engine. Not sure about that. 